Welcome. The following video will discuss add-on profile functionality, how to identify the drive add-on profile revision installed, where to download add-on profiles, and how to install them. Add-on profiles, or AOPs for short, allow drives to be easily added into an RS Logix 5000 or Studio 5000 project and provide the convenient graphic interface to configure the drive in a project. As new drive products are released and as the firmware of existing products is enhanced and updated, the AOP for that product must also be updated in order to utilize the full functionality of that product. To identify the current AOP revision installed on your computer, navigate to the Drive Properties window in an RS Logix or Studio 5000 project. Make sure the Properties window is not full screened so that the title bar is visible. With the title bar visible, left click on the white and blue icon in the top left hand corner of the window. Then select About Module Profile. The number listed for the software version installed is the current AOP version. It is important to note that AOPs reside on the individual computer or machine being used. For example, a user creates a project with a PowerFlex 755 on one computer with AOP version 4.07. Then the project is opened on another computer with AOP version 4.06. The functionality of the drive profiles in RS Logix or Studio 5000 on that computer will be that of version 4.06. To download a newer version of the AOPs, first navigate to the Product Compatibility and Download Center. A link has been provided in the description for your use. Once at this site, search for the Drive AOP and select Drive AOPs. This action should add the drive to the list on the right. Then click on the Downloads button. Once on the Downloads page, click on the Select Files checkbox. The available downloads window will appear. Now select the AOP for the drive you wish to use in the RS Logix or Studio 5000 project. If you are using a standalone PowerFlex 755, 753, 700, 70, 4 class or legacy scan port drive, make sure to select the AOP for PowerFlex 4 class and 7 class drives. If you are using a different drive product, choose the appropriate selection. With all of the desired files selected, Click the Downloads button. The following pages will have prompts for login information and the end user license agreement. Finally, select Managed or Direct Download and download the software to your computer. With the software successfully downloaded, unzip the files into a folder in the root directory of your computer. This will most commonly be the C drive. With all files unzipped to this new folder, make sure all Rockwell software has been shut down so that it will not interfere with the installation. Next run the mpsetup.exe file found in the new folder. After selecting Next, through the next few windows and accepting the end user license agreement, click the install button. 
After the installation is completed, the text in the status window should read all RSLogix 5000 module profiles on media are installed. After this window, click Next and then Finish. The AOP installation is complete. To ensure that the version is updated, follow the prior instructions on checking for the AOP revision. We thank you for watching, and if you desire additional references on this topic, please look at those provided in the description area below.